Who are you? Do I know you? I know the only reason to travel by train is to travel with weapons. And we all know that at the end of this line, there's only one creature worth killing. <laughs> Rick? Lower him into acid. Oh, Once gosh. Resolved, lower someone else into acid. What in the world? He is mean. You? How did you reach my sanctum? <laughs> All right, this is going in circles. Rick is nasty. He's a nasty old man. Whoa, he grew arms. What the heck? Childishness is happening. Anyway, he tells a different version of the story where I start crying or something. That's why he has to die. Because he's a liar. He's a liar. I'll take his turn. Here's why I'm going to kill Rick Sanchez. You guys have fun with this. Dissolve to a clam shaped sun. What? All these folks are trying to kill him. I suppose you think you have a better story about how Rick Sanchez saves space Christmas. What is what? with the Rick Sanchez obsession? Oh, yeah. Could have used Rudolph tonight. <laughs> oh, thank God. I'm not too late. I don't know Is this going to be all about morning. stories you of Rick? Go in there and have a nice time. I will. Thanks. Oh, he said thanks? Sorry if that was... No, um, uh, I can ask... No, no, no. I don't want to be a burden. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. That's just... There's a lot of people. Family, you know? I get it. You're not mad? Totally fine. Bye. He closed that door quick. Morty would have let him in because Morty's a softie. Tell your Christmas Rick story. Step the hell back. Back. What? You start teeing up a Rick Sanchez vignette and you'll be doing it through two <laughs> Doing it through. Tickets, please. She had a ticket. So, why did you date Rick Sanchez? Ice Queen? Uh, no, really, who? <laughs> exactly. Where's Unity? In fact, and get this, when he met my family. <laughs> Wolves? Jesus! I warned you not to do that. I wasn't trying. You don't have to. <laughs> he brought her back quick. Morty, I told you if you found me again, identify yourself. I didn't know it was you. What in the heavens? Why can't we find the engine? It's not a real train. It's a story device. Literally. What a in literal my brain? A device quite literally metaphorically containing us. A simulation. He doesn't want to hear his stories about himself. Okay, tickets please, guy. Stop the anthology. If we wanted one-offs, we'd do interdimensional cable, not some uptight overwritten. Oh, they punched him! Get to this point. Oh, he's a he, buff he, ticket he, man. This guy is cut. He, he's got those things. What, what do you call them? The, um, cum gutters. Morty what the, what's that mean? What does that mean? What is cum gutters? Why is his nipple so big? Wow, you are just <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, the Jackie Chan of human shielding. Who takes the time to get this good at... Fuck this. Oh! What in the heavens? You okay, Dad? Is this real? I doubt it. But you get what you get when you eat dinner in an arcade. I mean, are you real? Yes. I need your tickets. I need tickets. Everyone give me tickets! Whoa! Emergency continuity deployed. <gasps> what in the world? Train cops, in the air. Dream cops. Too soon. Too soon. Don't move. Too soon. Too soon. Too soon. Continuity. So, what did the train cops do wrong? Shot people. What the heck? I am so confused. Tank. Drop it. Drop, it. Drop the tank. <laughs> did they get blown up? It's just a training video. That didn't actually happen. That's what you think. Hey, how'd you get here? Yeah, like we're the ones that popped up out of nowhere. Fuck these guys. I am so confused. Continuity, dream, reality, what? So now we're <laughs> here, and the engine must be here. I'll have to rig us a couple of spacesuits that start failing around here. Why? We're obviously going to impart our own style. I don't like how meta oh, this is getting right. take it, please, guy. How is he still breathing? He's suspended in disbelief, slowly dying while living out an alternative non-diegetic reality. Jeez, what a horrible way it to die. It is a horrible way to die. Know, half of it. Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I get it. That was stupid. That, that's good old-fashioned fun right there. You know, we, we don't need to overthink shit, okay? Okay, buddy. Nice and grounded. Fully immersive from here on Them out. Too. Oh, gosh. They had a moment. Not quite a Birdman? Maybe what matters is to love yourself first and soar. Child of Aaron. 
Sure, that was a great moment, but it was hardly the best time Rick and Morty were musical. What the Who much? can forget the time? <laughs> what the what? <laughs> Galaxy's greatest scientists continue to ponder the her- What in the world is bleeding everywhere? If you're really enjoying this reaction and want to see the full uncut version, please join me over on Patreon. There you'll have access to all the shows you see here on YouTube and the Patreon exclusives. And don't forget before you leave to comment, like, and subscribe. Here's my new god. Check it. Is that brand new? Or is the blood just- Accurately depicted, yeah. His followers believe the entire universe is floaty bloody man's nightmare. Floaty bloody man's. <laughs> Okay, look, let's just do it once. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, Morty, tell a story unrelated to us. Oh, uh, what do. Stop thinking and do it. Uh, okay. Uh... I am so confused. This is so complicated. Hi. Hello. I want your cookies. I want your cookies. I'm not a writer, okay? <laughs> this is your story so was supposed whack. to be awful and stupid. I just failed to predict how well that would mesh with the theme. <laughs> Do you know what the Bechdel test is? This is the one no. for God's sake, Morty. The formula for measuring female agency in a story proposed by lesbian cartoonist Alice. Uh, Morty, two women. They both have to have names and talk to each other about something. Rick! Other than a man. Oh, Rick, listen to me. What in the world is happening this episode? Try my tea. It's so good. It's so warm. Mom, can I talk to you about my special time? It's okay. I have one too. Special time? Your special time is your power. It makes you strong like a boob. Strong like a boob? Oh. Fight them with your heavy special time. You do it too. <laughs> heavy special time! There's some coochie blasters! Great job, Morty. A feminist masterpiece. What in the heavens? Story Lord. I should have known you Lord. This, I did. Who is this guy? <laughs> Ugh, he's like a Matrix space Frasier. Let's get this fight over with nerd. <laughs> he's a nerd too. Spiraling through the multiverse, burping semi-improvised dialogue about how nothing matters, so we may as well pull out our dicks and rub them on fate's glaring teeth like we're brushing. That sounds painful. <laughs> Damn. We already did this. Oh, is this a double beat? Oh well, just how I adventure, dog. Dog. <laughs> Do we have to fight him? I don't want to. We surrender. We're not fighting. Oh. Hey, get back in your egg. He's naked, Morty. Uh, don't worry, Morty. Nothing out there is cannon. Nothing out there is cannon. <laughs> Professor Sanchez, did it work? I wouldn't say that, Marcus. I'd say it fucking worked. He didn't get dragged back. Morty, drag him back. I, I, I had a daughter. I, I didn't have a mustache. Uh, I was kind of funny sometimes. Mostly, Mostly burping. burping. Yes, he did. And farting. Oh! 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 I'm Morty Smith from the, 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 the 241st. They, they, they put your pill in our food. It, it worked. Call the police. It's okay. Call the police. <laughs> God, you're right. I should do more freeform stuff. What? This reality stuff is trippy. You idiots! Our potential isn't limitless. You'll never break the fifth wall before you burnt us out. Is that burnt so? us out. Oh well. Win win. He got baby oil all over him. Why is he so shiny? I can't believe you're finally headed off to college. <laughs> yeah. You know, it really oh, like summer. Be Seventeen forever. For like sixteen years at least. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? I'd be so nervous when it comes to Linkler? Linkler? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, he's the good stuff. yeah! Are there things Rick Sanchez holds sacred after all? Whoa, he's turning it up. Birdman! I trusted you! Don't blame others for your bad decisions! <laughs> they got Star Wars swords! Don't you wanna see how your story ends? <laughs> Oh, look at all the Ricks. Evil Morty. Sometimes it does seem like there's no way out. Like Evil it's hopeless. Morty's but remember, leading there's all of always them? someone there for us. Who? My best friend and personal savior, Jesus Christ. Your best friend? 
Jesus is always knocking at the door. All we have to do is open it and let him into our hearts. This is so weird Rick is saying this. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, thank you for thank sending you for your sending only, only begotten, begotten Son, Jesus. No, what sins. are you doing? Jesus, I accept you into my heart. No, this sucks. This sucks. In his name we pray. Amen. 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 You did it. Way to go, Lordy. Crossy, Bible Saurus, you made it. We would have missed this for anything. Are they supposed to be the VeggieTale characters? I beg your pardon? <sighs> God damn. <laughs> Thanks, Morty. Nobody ever wanted to see that shit. What? What's gonna happen to Story Lord? He gets to spend eternity in every writer's hell. The Bible. Oh. This was a little confusing, but I guess it brought us closer together, you know? I don't know about that. Now, what do you say we bring this train? They did not the just do that. What? What's that inside? A oh, fake? So, what do you think? Wow, where did you get this thing? The Citadel of Rick's gift shop. What? You did the most important thing. You, you bought something. What? What? You bought something with money. God, I love money. Yo, this episode is so confusing. You went into a store, an actual honest-to-God store, and you bought something. You didn't ask questions or raise ethical complaints. You you just looked straight into the bleeding jaws of capitalism and said, Yes, Daddy, please. <laughs> yes, Daddy, please. Give Grandpa a kiss. G g give me give Grandpa a kiss. Lips if you want. Wh whatever you're comfortable with. Some cultures do that. <laughs> Oh. Let's watch some interdimensional cable. Why does the house look weird? And we're in a toy train. Yes. It's enough to really make you question all of existence, isn't it? So what do you think you're gonna do about it? Oh, he's manipulating Jesus Christ. I wanna get the fuck out of here. Jesus would never Mother say that. Give me blood beyond sight. Hey, what the fuck? Blood beyond sight. Buy another one, Morty. Consume, Morty. Nobody's out there shopping with this fucking virus. Where's your fucking wallet? What in the heavens? What is going on? I am so confused. This episode legit. This episode legit. I don't know. I, I, maybe I just, I don't know what is happening. Tired of the same boring adventures with your dog shit, Morty? Yeah. No. The Citadel of Rick's story train comes with car after car of enemies, lovers, and Goomby. Goomby? Are they alive? Of course, but not in any ways that matter. They have no soul. They have no soul puppets. Just buy it. Not buying it is an act of buying it. Buy it now. Look it up. It's real. www.story-train.com. Story train. <laughs> this is ridiculous. 